guys, Papa Nina Brothers is back here in District 3 and we are heading up to Queen's Peak Condo, one of the newer projects along this entire belt. This is fully integrated, fully sheltered towards the Queenstown MRT station. And if you are looking to keep your price quantum under the $2 million mark for a compact 3 beta on a super high floor with great unblocked sea views, then join us on this home tour where Justin's gonna take you through the very first half. Alright, let's go! Before we kickstart Home Tour proper, we will be sharing more about the project facts of Queen's Peak. Queen's Peak is located in the Mature District 3 location. It is a 99-year leasehold project which TOP in 2020. There is a total height of 44 storeys spread across Block 1 and 3. So it is a really good density project with total of 336 residential units. Majority of the units here are contributed by 1, 2 and 3 bader. We have about 63% of the units here at Queen's Peak which are 2 bader and above size and layout. The profile of residents in this project are likely towards investors or smaller family types. The project was developed by MCC Land Singapore which was long established since 1996. MCC Land has been ranked among the top 10 property developers in Singapore for 4 consecutive years and has also received a few awards as well. It has a diversified portfolio of properties which comprise your residential and commercial properties. In terms of facilities, it comes with a full suite of facilities within Queen's Peak itself as well. We have three levels of facilities, level 1, 7 and 27. Each block has its own facilities which are almost mirror image to each which includes your 50 meters lap pool, kids play zone, indoor gym, barbecue pavilion and also your outdoor billiard arena. So what's so unique about Queen's Peak facilities that it also comes with a childcare centre which not every project has such facilities as well. So it would be great for families with young children and also we have a 7-Eleven right downstairs at your convenience too. This is a 3 beta compact unit that is standing at 861 square feet coming with your integrated living, dining and open kitchen concept with a 3 bed 2 bath as well as a really good sized balcony. So right here, we are coming to my favourite part of the home in this unit. We have the entire sea view and you also get a fantastic overview of the entire skyline because we are located on a really high floor. The sea view that you are overlooking right there is actually Singapore commercial biggest port terminal and also you get to see your iconic Sentosa which is right there. Balcony area area here is good size. If you just want to chill out here, you can put in an outdoor lounge set in your balcony space. The owners have already done up invisible grill as well as zip tracks in the balcony area. So you does get some shades from the sunlight that's coming right into your unit and you can also internalize your balcony space along with the rest of your home if you have to switch on the aircon as well. We are located along Dundee Road. This can be accessed via a few routes through your Commonwealth Avenue, Alexandra Road, Margaret Drive and Kaysiang Road. So having such multi-entry points really helps to beat the peak hour traffic jams which also makes it really handy when such need arises. If you are talking about MRT station, this is within less than 5 minutes walk to your Queenstown MRT which is actually just right at your doorstep. We are also less than 5 minutes walk to 3 bus stops which are around the vicinity which can directly lead you to city centre. If you drive, you are just less than 10 minutes drive to your AYE and CTE. Speaking of your amenities, you are approximately 10 minutes walk to Mailing Market and Food Centre and also your Margaret Drive Hawker Centre. You are also just within 10 minutes drive to the Orchard Shopping Belt. For parents with school going children, there are two primary school choices which are within the 1km radius which is your Queenstown Primary School and your Newtown Primary School. For your future exit audience, you actually have two potential groups. One will be your buyers looking to move closer to the town area. The other group will be your HDB upgraders and with the recent news that HDB around the Queenstown area has already hit the 1 million quantum mark. They might be your HDB upgraders who are looking to buy into the surrounding projects right here. Alright, so now let's head back to the unit to share more of the interior of the home. So 
right now we are at the foyer area where we have right here is this feature wall that has already been done up by the owners to nicely conceal their DB box that is right over here. So this is really a great idea if you need more space for storage in this unit. Coming to the open kitchen area where you have is actually your top hung and bottom hung cabinetries all done up nicely. You have your three burner cooking system, your hood and also your built-in oven. So you get a really good sink size. What I just want to point out to you is also this window right here at your open kitchen which you can actually open up whenever you are doing heavy cooking. Moving on, you have your washer placement right here and also your fridge placement. For those who prefer an enclosed kitchen, you can actually enclose this entire kitchen space right from here all the way to this corner right here. So this will be actually your wet kitchen area and right here you have your dry kitchen area which you can still do your meal preps. Now moving on to the dining area, so right now the owners have fitted in a six-seater dining set. I really love how this entire living dining kitchen space has been well integrated and now let's move on to the living area. So right now the owner have fit in a four-seater sofa set. What the owners have additionally done up is also this TV feature wall right here which you have even more storage space right at the top all the way down. So all in all it's really a good distance between your sofa and your TV area and right now I'll pass my time to Kayleen. She'll be sharing more on the rest of the home. a closer look in terms of the floor plans that we have over here at Queen's Peak as well as the different facings that you can find. So in the entire Queen's Peak itself, there are many different kind of 3 beta layouts. So from type C1 all the way until type C8. So generally across all these 8 different layouts, all your bedroom sizes are similar. The main difference only comes in the 3 different areas. Firstly, in terms of your balcony, whether you do prefer to have a bigger balcony adjoining together with one of your common bedrooms. The second difference will come in terms of your enclosed kitchen or whether it's an open kitchen and thirdly is whether you want that luxury of having a private lift within your unit. So the sizes here for the 3 beders range between 840 square feet all the way up to 1055 square feet. For our unit, we are standing in the type C2 which is also what we term as your 3 beder compact layout standing at 861 square feet and we've link it back towards the site plan itself. What you'll notice is that across this entire 8 different floor plans, there are two main facings that you can find. So one, either you're facing towards your Dundee Road which is also towards the kindergarten area. So naturally, that's going to be your quieter facing or the second one which is also where we are at is facing towards Commonwealth Avenue so of course you're going to face towards the MRT track but because we are on a super high floor that's also going to give you that beautiful sea view and completely unblocked right from a unit that you see as well so if you are looking to stay super super close towards the MRT area then technically in the entire Queenstown area there are only two projects for you to choose from the first one being Commonwealth House just adjacent to us and then of course we are here at Queenspeak which has this direct linkage towards the MRT area itself Naturally, if you want to be facing towards the sea view area and you want to have this compact size, then naturally you are only looking at stack 22 as well as stack 23, which is where we are at. Within the Queenstown area itself, there's definitely a nice handful of options for you to choose from. Let's say if size is your priority, then just across, we also have Queen's project. So if you're looking for something that has a larger floor plate, then definitely you can consider an older project, such as the one right across us at the Queen's QP back in 2002. Their floor plate stands about 1,184 square feet, asking about 1.9 to 2. $2.25 million and upwards. If you prefer something new, you can also consider Commonwealth Towers to POP back in 2017, standing approximately about 904 square feet, asking starts from $1.92 million to $2.15 million. And you want to be the newest kid in the area, then that's definitely going to be Sterling Residences, TOP just in 2022. 980 square feet to 1,055 square feet in terms of the three beders, asking at $2.25 million all the way up to $2.7 million. So coming back to our unit here at Queen's Peak, we just TOP back in 2020. We are one of the newest project here right smack next towards the Queenstown MRT station in terms of the price quantum at $1.98 million. So if you take a look at the east-west line, all the way from Clementi down towards Tiong Bahru MRT station, there are only two projects that has this direct linkage towards the MRT, which is really just us, Queen's Peak, as well as Commonwealth Tower. Naturally, if we are moving closer towards town, such as projects at the Red Hill MRT station, you have the Central Sky as well as Echelon. So because of their floor plate as well as location, they are already asking at $2.2 million and upwards and if we move towards Tiong Bahru area itself at this point of filming there is only one project available for sale at Central Green QP back in 1995 99 years leasehold the askings is also starting at 2.5 million dollars and upwards naturally also sold due to the larger floor plate that they do enjoy <laughs> Take 
a look at the master plan itself in Queenstown, just right at the old former cinema area. That's already been slated to be a retail building, so that's definitely going to be more conveniences as well as amenities coming your way. And just slightly further out, there are a lot of plots already earmarked as residential plots. So that definitely means that there's going to be a very healthy amount of projects, be it whether it's going to be a BTO project or whether it's going to be a private enclave that's going to come towards the Queenstown area itself. When we have this kind of rejuvenation as well as injection of new projects, that's going to set the new pricing benchmark in future, which also means that you being towards the Queen's Peak right smack towards the MRT area, technically your resale value will also be protected. And apart from that, right now we are very closely located towards all your amenities, be it in the Heartland area or be it towards the CBD as well as the Orchard Shopping Belt. Right beside us, we also have the newly opened up Margaret Drive Hawker Centre. check out the bedrooms itself. So for your first two common bedrooms, they are pretty similar in size and for the compact three beds here, in your common bedrooms, you can only fit in like the single bed or a super single bed. A queen size bed is definitely not going to really fit in here very comfortably. So you really have your built-in wardrobes done up by the developers as well and similarly across all your three bedrooms, you are facing towards that unblocked sea view. So across the hallway, you have a very sizable common bathroom. This one also comes with your own window which allows for natural ventilation. So you do have your glass door to separate between your wet and dry area and you already have some built-in cabinetries for all your storage needs. You also have this sliding panel over here to hide all your toiletries away. Heading back out, so the owners have also added this really nice design on this ceiling area to enhance the entire ambiance at night. So now heading on to your second common bedroom, so very similarly sized to your first one. Right now the owners use this as their kid study room but of course if you do want to fit in like a super single bed that's going to fit in right over here. And I really love the window panels here so it almost you have floor to ceiling window panels. So that's going to allow the entire room to feel super bright and you do also have very great crosswind ventilation across your entire home. So now let's head on to your main master bedroom itself. So master bedroom is very comfortable size. You can definitely fit in like a queen or even a king size bed over here. You still have ample space for your built-in wardrobes right along this panel. And of course, if you like to watch TV in your room, then this is a great TV feature wall area for you as well. And similarly, we do enjoy that floor to ceiling window height within your main master bedroom itself. And you're also going to enjoy that full unblocked TV you just right within this room. And because we are situated on one of the top few floors within Queen's Peak itself, that also means that we do have this added level of privacy because just right across us, that's Queen's Project which is already situated slightly lower in terms of their top floor level. That's also going to allow you to enjoy that beautiful unblocked sea view as well as that super great distance away from all your neighbouring projects for your added privacy. come to the end of the home tour if you're looking to stay in the city fringe area and you want to keep your price quantum under the two million dollar mark for a project that is relatively new right smack next towards Queenstown MRT station fully integrated fully sheltered then do come and check out this high floor three beta unblocked sea view facing unit with us so our listing manager contact details can be found in the link below do also subscribe to all our social media platforms my name is Kelly Leong and together with Jessin we are always happy to show you the place Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> you actually have two percent. Larger. Come, what the Lian Pu sing? back in 2012. Let me check.